Okay guys, welcome uh, to today's vlog. Uh, as you can tell, I'm going to go do a little biking here. Uh, go down the road for a little bit and I'll take you with us. Thanks for joining. So I just uh, stopped down here. Uh, one reason I took out the visor, I uh, found out why a lot of bikers don't wear the visors. It kind of gets in your way a little bit when you look it up. So I uh, took off the visor, and uh, so we're going to go on down the road here a little bit more. It's pretty out here, but cloudy, but still pretty. All right, guys, I'm back from my uh, bike ride. And man, I only biked about six miles. And man, that wore me out. When I got back to the house, I was wore out. I mean, it zapped me. It zapped me. So I, I took a shower, and here I am. Geneva went to the store. And uh, let's see what she got here, guys. Not much. She just picked up a few things. She didn't really actually do any grocery shop. I mean, no, a big shop. I just thing. done a fill in for what we needed. So let's see what we got over here. We got some bananas. A uh, some. Uh, thanks for Brady's thanks for Brady's lunch. Some tomatoes, carrots, some apples. Looks like she bought us some kind of little cake or something there. Uh, some salad fixings. So yeah. Oh, she got more stuff over here. Cheddar cheese, some beans, butter, and what is this? Pull and play. What in the world? It's a Kitty Cat's Valentine present. You fill it with treats and they knock it around and the treats come out. Uh-uh. Uh-huh. Oh my goodness, now we're going to make them work for the treats. Right. <laughs> That's crazy. So knocking around the treats come out. And that's how they get treats. Oh, that's that's cute. I gotta see that. Cause our cats love treats. So, all right, guys. Look, I'm filling up our new um, fruit basket. Yeah, Jenny bought some new uh, fruit baskets. As you can see, we're trying to get things more organized around here, rather than just sitting everywhere. So, uh, so yeah. All right. That's Very cute. good. Hey, Very I good. heard that you can wrap the stems. Of your bananas like that in cellophane and they'll keep longer so I'm really gonna try that. yeah wrap the stems the banana stems with cellophane and they'll keep longer yeah I'm gonna try that it might I mean it, I don't know might we'll see all right guys so Judy like I said she just got back from the store I just finally got my energy back <laughs> <laughs> Wow so what we got to do? Now you guys know why I was laughing so hard the other day. Man, what we got to do is jog. I mean, not jog, but ride maybe half that distance till I get used to it, and then stretch a little bit more. Because man, I really push myself. Well, six miles now, come a big, huge hill coming back up. Me and Brady, with the mountain bikes that we had, couldn't make it up the hill. But with the with the road bike, it's got a little bit better gearing. I made it up the hill, but man, that got me. I think that's what, plus it's at the end of the ride. So I came up the hardest part of the ride at the end. So that, that really got me. <laughs> hey, it was great going down it though. <laughs> now y'all know why I was laughing so much. I was keeping up with cars. Uh-huh. But uh, anyway, uh, I'm sure yeah. it was funny. All right, guys, I'm getting my exercise today. Bike six, bike six miles. Now Brady decided he wanted to come to the hotel. So we are walking to the hotel right now. And so that's another walk in another mile, mile and a half. It's big. We'll see you guys inside. Man, still pretty out here at night. Even, even at not at Christmas time, looks good. All right, let's keep on walking.
right, guys, we are done at the Upper Lake Hotel. That was some good uh, exercising, and it's always beautiful inside, no matter what time of the year you come there. So and Today uh, was a day for specific, specific people. And what kind of specific people did you see? Girls with very blocky heads. <laughs> they had, like, you know, eyebrows looking down, like, here, <laughs> looking like they're permanently mad, and they had the lips, like, oh, no. And very short people. Like, I was, I was taller than most people. I'm only 5'8". Okay. So, All right. So, yeah, they had a uh, volleyball tournament going on here. I don't know if it's high school or college, but uh, a lot of people here. Blockhead uh, volleyball. Brady's bad. <laughs> All right, so we're heading home. Janita's cooked an amazing dinner, so when I'm hungry, I've got all the exercise I need for the day. Let's go home, guys. All right, guys, I'm home. Brady and I are back from the Arkland Hotel, and just in time, as I told you, Janita's cooking an amazing dinner, and let's check this out. She just pulled something out of the oven here. If I can get around Max. <laughs> oh man, is these like cheese sticks? Yeah. Cheese, whatever you want to call it. Oh. It's puff pastry oh, man. with Parmesan cheese. Puff pastry with Parmesan cheese. And man, guys, I wish you could smell it because it smells amazing. And then right here, what is it, like a pot pie or something? Yeah, that's last night's chicken stew turned into Ooh. a chicken pot pie. Homemade thing. pot pie. Guys, and, and look at this over here. Look at this over here. Oh boy, look at this salad. Oh man, that smells amazing too. Man, that smells like spring right there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, that's gonna be it. Appreciate you watching there. Uh, I know I'm gonna be sore in the morning, but guess what? I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna do it again tomorrow. But this time, you're gonna bite six miles. I think I'm gonna go maybe about three, maybe four. We'll see. But uh, and then come on back. <laughs> We'll try to do a little bit, a little push myself a little bit more uh, as the week goes on. Each week, go another mile, another week, another mile. So uh, we'll see. We'll get in shape. But uh, guys, hey, I appreciate you watching. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it. And guys, as I've always said, uh, I don't listen to those people that's trying to hold you back. Go for your dreams. Take that leap of faith and jump. We'll see you tomorrow.